So I'm gonna rank all the High School Musical films in the order I want to, because it's from worst to best. So with that, let's get it ranked. In fourth place, we have High School Musical 2. Now it's not bad, but out of the trilogy and the fourth film, which is a spinoff, this one is the worst. Now it's forgettable. The songs are pretty good, but they're kind of also forgettable, except for the last one or a few. I'm not too sure. It's just pretty forgettable. I give it a 6 out of 10. Number 3, High School Musical 1. Now, I would have put in this as second place if it wasn't for number 2, 2 spot. Now, this film is a little bit forgettable, but not that forgettable. I don't actually find that that forgettable. I pretty much remember what happens, but I kind of forget about a few things that happen. The songs are great. The characters were great. Writing, I find it really good. I give it a 7.9 out of 10. I was confused, and then I decided to go with this movie guy's um, review kind of status. Number two, Sharpay's Fabulous Adventure. Before you say anything, this film is really good. Sharpay is a great character in this one, redeemed. Now, the only reason it's in second place, because it doesn't have a whole lot of songs, which is what you kind of need for a spinoff of High School Musical. And I know it's trying to be different, but still. It's not forgettable, and you like the film, but it's not. It's kind of hard to rewatch it sometimes. I give it an 8 out of 10. The only thing I didn't truly like about the film was that um, Sharpay had to do uh, this lady's, like this actress's chores and stuff. Because she's manipulating her. I didn't really like that because I felt like Sharpay probably wouldn't do it. Like, she would hesitate and then just say no. But she hesitated and say yes. Number one, High School Musical 3. Now, as far as when I first watched it, I loved this film. I consider it the best out of the trilogy. Um, I loved the song, cinematography, the writing was good. Now, there was a few things I didn't like, but overall, it was just pretty good. I give it an 8.5 out of 10. Follow for more movie reviews.